We just launched into an American style table using National Mahjong League rules at Mahjong time. If you don't play here yet, there's a link below the video so that you can come and play. Let's see if we can focus on some strategy theory for American style with these tiles. No multiples. This is a good way to practice what you can do when you have no multiples. It's pretty cut and dry. You just find a category that uses the most of your tiles and start there till you find a multiple. That's the strategy. So for this situation, we have three, four, five, six, or five, six, seven, eight. I think five, six, seven, eight consecutive run looks the strongest to me. We have one, two, three, four, five, six numbers in that range, and that gives us some tiles to pass. Let's see what happens with those number tiles. Anytime you have mixed suits, choose four numbers in a range and gather. We did pick up wins, so I'm going to haul off wins because if I get wins during the first Charleston, that can be a good switch if people are not holding wins. As an option, we do have fives and eights. Let's get rid of the six and see if we can focus on like numbers with eights, like numbers with fives, or wins. We just got a wind and a five, so we have tiles we can pass. We're holding wins and fives at this point. We have one multiple with the wind and, of course, a pair of flowers. We could maybe play wins with flowers. Let's see if we can get some more wins out of this Charleston. We've got tiles we can pass. Really good ones, too. Evens, odds, mixed suits. This is a good pass. You know, I probably should have kept that seven ban and kept consecutive because potentially we could have played a news consecutive hand, but there, there are still possibilities there. We got wins and a five. Let's keep the five pair here and pass these three. Because we're potentially playing a pair hand, I'm going to risk passing like numbers. I try to do that rarely, but there are circumstances that make it a, a good risk. In this case, we picked up a potential sequence tile. I think we could go ahead and pass one blind. I'd say we're in between the news concealed hand with flowers or the news pair hand. I don't remember if there were was a four bam floating around here. We got a south. We got a keeper. So now we have to choose news. They only want two tiles. I'm just going to pass one. And that way we can leave options open and play either the pair hand or the news concealed hand, depending on what we get during the pick and discard phase of the game. Either way, we're two or three away. Three away from a concealed hand and two away from a pair hand. And we have to pick a hand or either give Three up bamboo. one of these. We need either a four bam or a six bam. Three, Three characters. characters. Let's give up the five bam there. You only need pairs. Five bamboos. So if we get a four bam, we'll get rid of the seven bam. If we get a six bam, we can get rid of the three bam. And we still Eight don't have bamboos. to decide between the two hands until we, we get to a decision point. Seven, Seven characters. characters. We don't need the one. Just one tile at a time one at this bamboo. point. Well, I suppose if you think about it, it's always one tile at a time when you're picking and Two discarding. Bamboos. One tile at a time. 
one character. Four characters. Okay. Let's give up the seven bam. Seven bamboo. I probably should have. Well, either way, we're still in between. I think three characters. If we draw in a four bam, we can get rid of the flowers. Two if we characters. build up any wins, I think I'll play the concealed Five news characters. hand. Oh, there's the four bam. Plum. So we have all the wins. We need a three bam and a four bam. One away from a pair hand. South wind. Now there's one three bam out right now. So that is something to keep in Green mind. Green dragon. Six dots. And there's a west. Orchid. Two bamboos. One character. Nine characters. West wind. We got an eight bam and there's a joker over here. White dragon. So we'll see what happens. Six bamboos. We already gave away the flowers and the uh, west is out, a south is out. Six dots. We need a three bam or a four bam. Nine, Nine dots. dots. Six bamboos. There are two six bams out. Nine, Nine characters. characters. If we draw a six bam, we can get rid of this eight bam. Seven dots. Seven characters. Two bamboos. One character. It'd be nice to pick a tile. Three bamboos. Oh no. So three Six bam. Characters. Three bam went down. There's two out now. getting tight two bamboos one recourse will be to snag that joker and Eight switch characters. to a news hand we could always draw flowers again and use the joker for these missing two tiles there the south Five and the west characters. nine dots until that three bam goes down we're gonna go for the pair hand west wind if we switch to the news hand, we're going to need jokers. Seven bamboos. Two dots. Nine bamboos. Six dots. One bamboo. Four bamboos. Okay, we need that tile. We needed that tile. So now Five there's two characters. three bams, a four bam, and two six bams are out. So this is getting sketchy. Five dots. Two characters. The nice thing about pair hands is if it goes dead, you have joker bait. So we could switch to a news Two hand characters. and use these tiles as joker bait. At least the fives. There are no five bams out. Oh, there's one five bam out. Two actually. dots. So we'll see what happens here. There's it's still viable. East wind. All oh, these winds are going down. Seven dots. Bamboo. One character. Seven bamboos. Six bamboos. Okay, there's the third six bam. So the only four thing characters. we can do is that three bam, four bam. 
We've got to get that three bam. Seven characters. Six dots. Push if you can till it goes down. Stick with it. Especially if you're one or two Three away. Dots. Stick with it. And then regroup if the hand goes East dead. Wind. We'll just need lots of jokers if it goes dead. Eight or dots. switch to defense. You could always just switch to My defense. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. The four bam was over here. Three bam was still out. Very nice. Okay, let me know what you thought about that hand. We were one away from a pair hand. I think that's a good exercise in how to push a pair hand. It was still viable. Uh, we just needed that three bam badly, but it was viable. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, consider subscribing. Click the bell when you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or maybe pick up an insight of the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next strategy theory using National Mahjong League rules at Mahjong time, may all your picks be keepers.